Hello and welcome to this Ferris State Football Week 2 preview. I'm the voice of the Bulldogs, Rob Bentley, joined by Sandy Golston as we get set for Saturday night, Ferris State and Ashland in a showdown at Jack Miller Stadium down in Ashland, Ohio. The Bulldogs coming off a big win, 54-14 over Findlay in the season opener right here at Top Taggart Field last week. And Sandy, an impressive debut for the Ferris State Bulldogs. Yeah, really in all three phases of the game. Bulldogs uh, gave up the early touchdown, but they were undaunted after that first touchdown. Bulldogs did a great job bouncing back, getting focused all three phases of the game. Uh, uh, there's always some things that you can work on, of course, but the Bulldogs have to feel pretty good about that. Dominating victory before a great crowd here under the lights at Top Taggart Field. Obviously the first game for Ferris State since 2019, the debut game here on the college football level for Jared Bernhardt, the Bulldog quarterback, seven touchdowns he accounted for on Saturday night and tremendous performance in his uh, first start as a Bulldog. Well, I tell you what, that's a great place to put the bar right there. I don't know uh, where you go from there, but a terrific performance by Jared Bernhardt. He really came out and set the tone. What I really liked, Rob, about him, his composure, playing his first college football game, uh, his first football game since high school, and he came out with the composure of a fifth, sixth-year senior playing the game. So it was really great to see. I think he had a great debut, but I think uh, the team really did a great job of supporting him. The offensive line, which we knew was going to be a strength, proved to be a strength again with the way that they dominated the line of scrimmage in terms of the passing game as well as the running game. So lots of things really working in his favor to be able to have a performance like that. This week, the Bulldogs will take on Ashland University, a tough matchup again, always a, a tough uh, opponent here in the Great Lakes Intercollegiate Athletic Conference. This will be a non-conference game now. Ashland and Ferris State have uh, won five of the last six GLIAC championships and really been the two uh, powers here in the conference in recent years. Well, it's just great that we're able to keep this rivalry going with Ashland. We've been able to keep the rivalry going with Finley as well, two very good opponents, two opponents that we know very well from competing in the GLIAC. So we know Ashland's going to be a good team. They play well at home. They're a very well-coached team, Coach Lee. Owens does a tremendous job with his squad. So you know they're going to come in. They're going to play disciplined football. They showed against Notre Dame College. Even in a loss, they can put up some numbers. So uh, they do have some experience at some key positions. And they're going to put forth a formidable task for the Bulldogs. Bulldogs are going to have to be on their game Saturday night. The Bulldogs uh, set a school record with their 29th consecutive regular season win uh, here uh, on Thursday night. What will it take to get win number 30 uh, in a row here in the regular season on Saturday? Well, Rob, I think when you look at a game like this, going on the road for the first time, uh, potentially with a young quarterback uh, at the helm, you're going to have to make sure that you keep your mistakes at a minimum early in the game to make sure that you don't feed into the crowd and you don't get the crowd going and put yourself at a deficit early. So making sure you take care of the football early, attack where you can, be efficient where you can no mistakes on special teams there's probably a few areas in special teams the Bulldogs maybe want to look at cleaning up a little bit from game one against Finley going into game two they say you make your biggest improvement from game one to game two and the Bulldogs certainly hope that's going to be the case the, Bulldog la the Bulldogs last loss uh, here in the regular season came in 2017 at this very uh, stadium Jack Miller Stadium down in Ashland Ohio and obviously the Bulldogs have a, a ton of veteran experience uh, a lot of those guys may be around back then and and they certainly know what it takes to win here on the road yeah and they're gonna have to call on that experience when you think about going down there on the road against the very good opponent uh, in a road environment where you know the crowd we know what it's like because we had a great crowd here for Finley uh, you would expect that Ashland going to have something pretty similar down there so you really want to lean on that veteran experience to be able to get you through uh, the emotion at least the initial emotion that you would expect from the home team early on so hopefully the Bulldogs can use that experience ride that experience well on both offensive and defensive lines and at the other positions that they can really sustain that early onslaught that we would expect from Ashland to be able to persevere through to the end. The Bulldogs moving up to number two this week in both the D2 football and the AFCA Division II national polls. But one thing uh, Coach Anise has been able to do in his tenure here at Ferris State, really keep it focused on one game at a time. Yeah, he is. He, he's not really so much worrying about the, the national polls. Uh, you know, you'll worry a little bit more about the regional polls when those start to come out. But right now, he's just focused on one game at a time. The team is focused on one game at a time. And that's the value also of not only an experienced coaching staff, but also an experienced group of players that have been in this program for a number of years. So they know what it takes. They know it's one game at a time. You can't look past Ashland and start looking at Saginaw Valley or opponents that are coming later on in the schedule. you got to focus on a very good Ashland team right now, and hopefully that experience will help the Bulldogs stay focused here on Saturday night. The Bulldogs will take on Ashland this Saturday night before they return home to play Saginaw Valley State on September 18th. Davenport for homecoming on September 25th. Kickoff set for 7 p.m. at Jack Miller Stadium in Ashland, Ohio. We'll have the pregame coverage for you starting at 6.30. All right, here on Sunny 97.3 FM and online at FerrisStateBulldogs.com. For Sandy Golston, I'm Rob Bentley. This has been the Week 2 Preview for Ferris State Football.